Hello everybody, and it's now time for my weekly pickups. I know it's a little bit late today, but uh, I had things to do, so at least enough is getting up there. <laughs> uh, first, I'm going to start off with uh, four DVDs that I picked up this week. Oh, well, picked up, and that is Dragonheart. Picked this up at the dollar store. Excellent movie if you haven't seen it. I'd recommend going, get it, uh, going and getting it or watching it. It stars Dennis Quaid and Sean Connery as Draco. Great movie. Uh, when King, when Godzilla first came out, the movie, it, Walmart went crazy and had some uh, Godzilla movies, which is very rare for the Walmart around here. And this was in the five dollar bin, King Kong vs. Godzilla. If you want a good laugh, I would watch this one because look how King Kong looks on the cover, and this is how he looks into the movie. Um, very cheesy Godzilla movie. I still recommend it to people. I like it. Um. Very rare movie to get to, especially for five dollars, because that movie goes ridiculous prices online. Uh, next one is the Doc, the Island of Doctor Monroe. Uh, watched this when I was younger. Don't much, don't remember very much about it. So that's the reason why I picked it up. It's the uh, director's cut on top of that. So, and I still never watched this one, so I had to pick it up. Pirates of the Caribbean on Strange Tides. Uh. Yeah, I have nothing to say about that one. It's the newest one in the installment. Uh, I'm going to show off some non-game, like, it's game-related, but non-game video games. Uh, well, this one's a video game. Picked up Serious Sam at a yard sale for the PC. Um, very serious first-person shooter. I love how it says that on the side. Uh, I'm thinking we're just going to keep this for more of a uh, display on my shelves when I do build them. Um... Or trade it away eventually. I don't know yet. Uh, I'm not 100% sure about it. So, yeah, serious Sam. Uh, picked up a Mario plush, big Mario plush. Uh, like I said, I don't have much memorabilia, so a video game. So, when I start seeing it now, I picked them up. Picked up uh, Skylander Swap Force Punk Shock. This is the Easter egg one. Uh, apparently this is pretty rare. I don't know. I picked it up when they when they were out, so and I just forgot to show it off. Uh, next next things I picked up were all at the dollar store. It's these uh, racers that you pull back and they race and everything like that. I picked up all five of them. There were supposed to be five in a set, so I picked them all up. Uh, first one is Princess Peach. This is for Mario Kart Seven. Toad. Mario, can't forget Mario, uh, Luigi, and apparently this is the hardest one to get, and there was tons of them at the dollar store, well, the dollar ram around here, and that is Koopa Turtle, or Goomba, yeah, it's a Koopa Turtle, and yeah, they were there for $3 a piece, I had to pick them up, so, uh, first thing I got is, this is all from Swagbucks again, I got another $25 Amazon card, so I used it up and bought some more video games. I think uh, I went over the limit of twenty-five dollars this time, and uh, I think I paid like eighty-nine cents for these games. First one is Prince of Persia: Rival Swords for the PSP. Looks pretty cool in the back. Looks like a unique title for the Prince of Persia thing uh, franchise. Next one is Tom Clancy's Splinter Cell Essential Essentials. Uh, like I said, this was eighty-three cents. Uh, next one is Peter. Peter Jackson's King Kong, the official game of the movie. Um, heard this is a hidden gem for many systems, so I had to pick it up. Next one is Beowulf, the game. I heard there were some hard levels in the 360 version of that. I'm not 100% sure about that one. Uh, next two games, I was surprised to find this at a pawn shop because we have a lot of resellers and repickers around here. They buy them up and then uh, resell them. The first one is The Legend of Zelda, A Link to the Past, Four Swords. Paid, uh, I think, 10 for that one or 5. And The Legend of Zelda, Spirit Tracks. I paid 10 for this one. And don't know much about these yet. I never played them yet. When I get around to playing them, there will be a review up of both of them. Uh, a couple weeks ago, you seen me get the Collector's Edition of Doom Tree. So when I seen this on there, I had to get it. It was just to finish off my Doom Uh series on the original Xbox and that's Doom Tree Resurrection of Evil. I know it's just the expansion pack. I think it's on the Doom Tree. 
itself. So, uh, next one is a Wii game, Sonic and the Secret Rings. Also, True Swag Bucks picked this up. Well, True Amazon, off of my thing. Um, next one, I have the Greatest Hits version of this. So when I seen it for two, uh, I think it was a dollar. I picked it up just to get rid of my Greatest Hits, and that is WWE SmackDown versus Raw 2007. Like I said, I'm trying to get rid of my greatest hits, so... And these next four games, I think, uh, were the last four I got with uh, my Amazon card. Uh, like I said, I only paid 80-some cents a piece for them. First one is the Fairy Odd Parents Breaking the Rules. I love my platforming games. This looks like a good platformer. Uh, Blood Omen 2 played this... Well, sorry, Legacy of Kane series, Blood Omen 2. I played it um, on the GameCube... Uh, Found the graphics were pretty cool and whatnot, and I love the Legacy of Kane games for its uh, horror survival type thing. Well, you're playing as the vampire. Next one is Indiana Jones and the Staff of Kings. Don't know much about this one, just picked it up because it was cheap. And Robin Hood, Defender of the Crown, made by Capcom. Like I said, don't know much about this one either. So that's my pickups for this week. I uh, got a lot of got some memorabilia into there, so I'm happy about that. And I'm happy to have my Zelda games. So I'm starting to get it like uh, the Zelda games. So I'm happy about that. I'm not sure how many more there is to pick up for game wise. Uh, I'll have to do like a complete list of it. But uh, yeah, uh, if you like this channel and like this uh, video, please like, subscribe, um, uh, leave a comment what you think about the video, everything like that. And that's it for now. I will have another pickup video next week. Uh, game review this week and as usual my dvd watches so you all take her easy keep gaming everybody and remember to spread the word of the mad gamer